Stan Gibalisco here, uh, author of Teach Yourself Electricity and Electronics, 5th edition, a link to which uh, I will include in the description of this video, so you can go to Amazon.com and buy it if you want, or if you want to check it out at your local library, you can do that too. Uh, Anyway, what I'd like to talk about here is a little more about power supplies and half-wave rectifiers in particular. In the previous video in this playlist, Teach Yourself EE Miscellany, which I made just a few minutes ago from the timestamp on this one, uh, this is a half-wave rectifier circuit here, and this is the output waveform that you get from such a circuit. Pulsating direct current. Not suitable for most electronic equipment because they want smooth direct current like you would get from a battery. Well, how do you get that? The simplest way to do that is to connect a large value capacitor, an electrolytic capacitor, uh, probably at least 40 or 50 microfarads, depending on uh, what kind of a load you put on here, how much current this thing has to deliver. The more current it has to deliver, the larger this capacitor has to be. The smoother you want the direct current, the larger the capacitor has to be. And some of them get upwards of 470 microfarads. But you can get even better filtering if you're willing to use a device called a filter choke, which is an extremely large value inductor, uh, on the order of one Henry or more. And there are two ways you can connect that in a configuration with the capacitor to get even better smoothing of the pulsating direct current than you would with the capacitor all by itself. You can put the coil in series and the capacitor in parallel, put the capacitor first closer to the rectifier and the coil after that. That is called a capacitor input filter. Does that surprise you? Here's the input and here's the output in this circuit. You simply put the coil ahead of the capacitor and then you get a choke input filter. So that's how you can filter out the uh, direct current from this. Stan Gibalisco, proprietor and operator of amateur radio station W1GV, saying 73, which means best regards in ham radio jargon, and so long for now.